Hey everyone, time for another quick gaming update. So I've got Versailles 1919 back to the table, a Mark Herbert, a Herman and Jeff Engelstein game. And if you might recall from one of my earlier plays, I wasn't overly impressed with this game out of the box. Having said that, I've only played it solo, so these are my solo perspectives. Still, I wanted to give it another try before I wrote it off completely as a solo game. And I must say, um, I've just finished this game, having scored only 14 points. Uh, where 20 is the victory. Uh, I must say I enjoyed it more than my first outing as a solo game. Uh, still, I, I have difficulty making a connection to the theme, which disappoints me a little bit. Uh, maybe that would shine through more in the multiplayer game. That said, uh, I did find the game more interesting. Uh, it's very much a card manipulation game and, uh, and the like. Um, and I'm going to give it another go. I was thinking maybe I'll be selling this game. But from a solo perspective, maybe there's a glimmer of hope. I'll, I'll try it again and give you an update from that uh, solo uh, point of view. Looking forward to maybe give this try a game a try multiplayer. A bit difficult where I live at the moment in Auckland because we've been in lockdown about 11 weeks now. Or should I say lockup? So I uh, can't play with anyone. Um, so there's a little bit of hope that there's more to Versailles 1990 than I initially thought. I'll keep you updated on that one. Okay, coming up next, uh, I'm going to play Pax Transhumanity, which just came in the mail today. Looking forward to this one. This is a Matt Eklund game, son of Phil Eklund, the amazing designer of uh, High Frontier, one of my favourite games. Uh, these uh, Pax games pack a massive game in a small box. Uh, so really looking forward to this one here. Uh, I'll, I'll give you a bit of a, uh, a preview of it when I play it and that's the situation guys and um, I'll keep you updated hope you're all doing well uh, maybe better than we are locked up living between home the grocery store I still got to work and home again it's pretty dull okay thanks guys <laughs>